Hey pen testers, Braden here for Pen Tester, and today we've got a pretty cool one for you. This is a pen that we have from one of our followers. It's called the Cork Coaster, and basically what we do is we take a picture frame, just a standard picture frame we picked up from Hobby Lobby, and it's a two by three inch picture frame. We take wine corks and we make a wine cork coaster and it just sits just like that and it's a coaster for your uh, drinks and so now we're gonna test this pin out and see if it's as easy as it seems all right so like I said we've got the picture frame here we've got our corks and we have a hot glue gun so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna make this thing work so Got to remove the back of the picture frame. You're left with something with the hollow frame itself. Put this over here. So now, what you do is you just slide these corks in here. I'm doing. Now a problem you could run into is sometimes there's a little room left over, like right here. So what we're gonna do is we've taken a cork and we've cut it to fit the hole. So instead of trying to jam it into the front right here, put it right under in the back of the frame, just like that. just like that. So we still have the cork right here, and it's a continuous pattern of cork. So now we have to use the hot glue gun to secure this. And the way we do that is pretty simple. We just turn it over and apply hot glue to wherever the cork is meeting the frame. And so now, I'm just gonna make sure that they're all in place. And it's all even in the back. And just like that, you've got a cork board coaster. All right, so my rating on this cork coaster is a fairly good one. As far as cost goes, these wine corks are extremely cheap. You can get them anywhere for very, very cheap. The frame itself, I got for $2. So we're still under the $5 mark for this pin. So for cost, it's got five pins all day. For the time that it takes, I'm gonna go with five pins as well, just because that took me five minutes. So I mean, the longest part was waiting for the glue to dry. So that also gets to five. And as far as difficulty, as long as you're old enough to handle a hot glue gun, you're gonna be just fine. So we're gonna give a five there as well. So we give a score of 15 pins to this pin. And uh, that pin's been tested. 